Hi guys, welcome back. So we completed almost all the models. So in this video, we will be completing the rest of the modeling part. So the next thing is we have to focus on creating this floor tiles, uh, the small rocks, something like that. So for that also, we'll be focusing on that. Uh, we'll be using the poly cube. So you can go to the poly modeling shelf and uh, we will just select the cube and we can go to the top view and we will create a small cube roughly like that and you can go to the friend view and you can adjust the height okay. once that is done you can just move it up then we will add a subdivision width one and the subdu subdivision depth also we will add one after that we will just double click that particular edge loop and we will just slightly scale it so the final shape will look, be looking like a small cylinder kind of shape once that is done you can just move it down we'll just press 3 on the keyboard and now we have a model of a that rocks and you can just move them around and you can align them like that so once that is done you can just go to the top view and we will just make a few more duplicates and while duplicating it we'll just make them scale down or scale up and we can make you can align the models like that so i'll just continue this process and uh, I'll create a few more rocks and uh, to make some changes in the shape of the rocks what you can do is you can just edit the vertex of each of the rocks and you can just uh, extend uh, some areas to make it more like uh, organic or something like realistic rocks something like that so after that you can just uh, rearrange them and uh, duplicate them and you can make few more rocks like that okay so we actually completed that uh, rocks also uh, the next thing is we have to create uh, this plants uh, here you can see some plants and uh, some extra details uh, we have to create so we'll just uh, focus on the plants next we also will use the poly cubes so first we'll create a select cube we'll create a cube roughly the size of the plant we'll just give them okay after that uh, the top vertex will just uh, scale it down to create a taper if in effect after that we'll add a few edge loops here in order to create uh, this branches then we will select the faces here and we are going to extrude so we will extrude and uh, I am pressing G in between to re-enable the extrude uh, tool so it will be much easier and uh, for tools also it's always easy to use the shortcuts here i am pressing g in order to enable that uh, extrude option after that i am using the w key to move that shape and uh, 
ಈ ಲೆಟರ್ ಈ ಒಂದು ಕೀಬೋರ್ಡ್ ಎನೇಬಲ್ ದ ರೊಟೇಟ್ ಟೂಲ್ ಇನ್ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಟು ರೊಟೇಟ್ ದ ಶೇಪ್ ಸೊ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ದಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫೈನಲ್ ಏರಿಯಾ ಐ ಇಲ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಕೇಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಡೌನ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ಆರ್ಡರ್ ಟು ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟ್ ಎ ಟೈಪರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಒನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಎಂಟೈಯರ್ ಮಾಡಲ್ ಇಸ್ ಫಿನಿಷ್ಡ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ರೊಟೇಟ್ ದಮ್ ರಿಯಲ್ ಇನ್ ದಮ್ ಅವರ್ ಯು ಒನ್ ಸಿ ನೌ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಿ ದಟ್ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಬ್ರಾಂಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಪ್ರೆಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಆನ್ ದ ಕೀಬೋರ್ಡ್ ನೌ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸಿ ದ ಪ್ಲ್ಯಾನ್ ಹೌ ದ ಪ್ಲ್ಯಾನ್ ಇಸ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಪ್ರೋಸೆಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಅದರ್ ಸೈಡ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಸೊ ದ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಐ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಡಿಲೀಟ್ ದ ಬಾಟಮ್ ಶೇಪ್ once that is done uh, we will continue the second part uh, the second uh, branch so just select the face okay so we just completed the second branch also i'm just going to scale them down uh, to create a taper so once that is done uh, now we actually finish the plant uh, shape so the entire model is completed you can add a few uh, one edge loop in the corner to maintain that uh, details okay so this is our plant so after that you can just add some thickness and uh, just after that you can just uh, select this vertex and uh, you can move them back move them around in order to create some organic kind of effect okay so we just completed our plan after that you can just uh, move them around and uh, you can align them in your model and we will just make a few more duplicates and uh, we will just uh, fill that uh, model okay that's the plants and uh, in the next video we will add uh, the few more details and we will finish up the modeling So I'll see you guys in the next video.